In this video, we're going to talk about using templates on client accounts. As an agency, you're managing multiple client accounts and services. Each client will obviously have their own set of unique needs and goals, but many of the reports and deliverables that you create usually share some common elements. For example, whether it's SEO, social media, or campaign performance, you're often presenting similar dashboards or data to each client. With Databox, you can actually save custom dashboards as templates and use them on every client account. This is great because instead of starting from scratch every time you need to create a report for a client, you can leverage the templates you already created for your services that include all the necessary KPIs, formatting, and branding elements. And then once you use the template, you can obviously continue to customize those dashboards according to your client's needs. So this could be, for example, adding or removing specific metrics and KPIs, changing the logos of your dashboards, and so much more. Okay. So let's assume that I've created a dashboard to help me track organic traffic to my client's website. So prior to this video, I actually built this dashboard and I want to turn this dashboard into a template. So to do that, I'll just select the option under more and save as template. I can choose to rename my account template but for now, I'm just going to leave the name as is, and then I can also choose who has access to this template. And again, I'm just going to leave it for everyone. So I can go and press save. And now if we navigate under account templates, we can see here our new template that we saved, which is the master template organic traffic. Now to use this template on a client account, we'll first need to switch to a specific client account. So we've built this on the agency. So let's go and switch to a client. And for this example, let's use client B. And to find that template again, we'll find it under data boards and account templates. One thing that I do want to point out is that in client accounts, account templates are divided into two sections. At the top here, you'll see all the account templates that you've saved that are unique to this client. And here at the bottom, you'll see all the templates that have been saved in the agency account. So because we created our template or saved our template in the agency account, we can find our template here. And to use that template, let's just select use template and pick our data source. Okay, now that we've created this dashboard in the client account, you can continue to customize this to fit your client's needs. So like I mentioned in the beginning of the video, by selecting edit, you can choose to add or remove metrics from this dashboard, update the colors, change the logos, add it to a loop and just so much more. Okay. Now let's go back to our agency account and back to our data board. And let's just assume that we wanted to know how people are accessing our client's website. Currently from the dashboard template that we created, we can't really see data on whether people are using their phone, computers, or tablet. So we want to include a metric like sessions by device category to help us monitor this activity but manually updating each dashboard that we created from this template is going to be a time drain. Instead with data box, we can actually update the master template and have changes automatically reflect on all dashboards created from that template. So for example, if we've used this template for client A, B, and C, we can push the changes to all the client accounts. So let's actually go ahead and do that. Now let's go, back to data boards under our agency account and select account templates. And under our master template organic traffic, let's click edit. To add a new visualization, I'm just going to go under the metric library and select sessions by device category. And let's just drag and drop that onto our dashboard. I'm just going to make a few changes quickly. So I'll quickly just expand the data block 
and let's change this to a table visualization. Okay, now with my template updated, I can push all of these changes to the dashboards that were created from this template by selecting the button at the top here, Update Data Boards. And like I said, we've used this templates on client A, B, and C. So let's just tick all of the templates and all of the client accounts that we want to push this change to. And let's just click select and yes, update. Okay, now all of the dashboards that have been created from this template should be updated. So let's go ahead and check back on client B. And if we go back to data boards and select view, we can see here that the new metric that we added sessions by device category is now available.